Hey everybody, this is Scott. Today is Saturday, July 25th, 2020. And I'm gonna put together a couple videos for this weekend, for whatever I managed to get done this weekend. I'm gonna start working on this front area right here. I got two new duck blocks and 4x4s in place. I talked about in a previous video how I've decided to just wall in this front because I haven't been happy with the idea of doing the uh, wire mesh and concrete fake wall, fake stone cliff process. I haven't been enthusiastic about that, so I've decided to alter my plan and I'm going to just make this upper loop the same front wall is over there. So I'm going to start working on that this weekend. It's going to be hot this weekend. It's going to be 90 and humid today and tomorrow. So I'm probably only going to work a little bit in the morning and a little bit in the evenings. I'm not going to do anything midday. I'm a hoot is out hanging out with me. I'm a hoot also does not like the heat. She is not a fan. So I'm a hoot and I will be in midday. That's what we do. Right, Hoot? Here's the Hoot. There's the Hoot. Yes, good girl. So, I will document whatever gets done today and tomorrow. I'll probably make part two at the end of the day Sunday. I'd like to have the whole front wall done. Um, right after I'm done filming, I'm gonna take the scrap wood bridge apart. That's been up for, I think, three years this summer? Two or three years, I'm not even sure. So, that is it for Saturday morning update. And I will make part two probably tomorrow. Okay, thanks. Hey everybody, this is Scott. This is part two of the platform video. It is not the following day, Sunday. It is actually two weeks later. Today is Saturday, August 8th. Two weeks after part one, but that's okay. These things happen. I'm making part two today because I have just finished the front of the platform. Wasn't the original plan, but I'm happy with it. It solves a problem I was having with the design of the railroad. So, I think it's going to work out nice. And one thing I thought of, if I ever decide I want to build the big curved trussle with the pond behind it, my original plan, I can take this front wall out. That actually wouldn't be terribly difficult at all. I can just remove it. So, who knows, maybe five years from now, I'll want to do my original plan. Probably not, but you never know. So next, I have two directions I can go. I can finish the top of this platform and scenic it, like over here, or I can work on the pond, the stream, and the waterfall in here. And I've decided I'm going to do that instead because I'm kind of tired of working with benchwork and lumber. So I'm going to give this a break. I have a feeling at this point in the year that this top probably won't be done until next year, but we'll see. So instead, I'm going to start working on my stream and my waterfall. I'm going to have a series of cascading waterfalls going down to the lower pond, which will be in here. So that's what I'm going to work on next. So, that is it. Just wanted to update on the big platform. There it is. So that's where we stand. Okay, I'll see you next time. Thanks.